Hello, gorgeous ladies and gentlemen of the realm. Fairy Vixen here, back again with a $1 necklace pop-up. So, fasten your seatbelts. These are going to be all dainty little necklaces. They are going to be a dollar each. Um, please, the way that we work this is, if you see one that you like, you put a timestamp of that item in the comments below. Please make sure that your timestamps are precise. Um, if I have a blank screen or there is no jewelry on the screen, at the timestamp that you specify, your your posting will be skipped. I'm very sorry. That's just to make it uh, fair for everyone. Um, yeah, so we're just going to blow through this right quick. Um, I have quite a few here. Um, our first one is this little tiny CZ crystal on a silver tone chain. Oh wow, that messes up the camera, doesn't it? Um, it's on a silver tone chain. I'm pretty sure it's not silver, but it is also magnetic. The magnetic clasp is attached to the normal clasp on this. You can take it off. Um, the magnetic one is quite worn, so what we're going to say is whoever owned this probably switched this out between a lot of different necklaces. So um, You can either use that or not, depending on what your preference is. So that is uh, our first little guy. Let's show you some better, a better... Hey! Eh, come on to focus! There we go. Now you can see it a little better. There you go. Little CZ crystal. She's cute. Alright, so put that one there. Okay, and then this next one is a threefer, pretty much, because it is a, a triple strand guy. It is a loft piece. It is a little black one, a little swirly one, and then the one down at the bottom is like a stripy cream color. All three chains are different styles. This is the one with the little, little teeny stations on it. This one has some bar chain interspersed with some little tiny rollo chain. And then the top one is just your normal, whatever that link is called, the normal chain. So that is number two, and that is another dollar. Please do use timestamps. Do not use the numbers that I'm saying. I'll try to refrain from saying numbers anymore. None of this is sterling. There will be some stone, but there is no sterling or gold that I know of. This one has a mark on it. Mer, you might be getting something good here. Let me see. That's a goldsmith mark. We're not gonna... Maybe scratchy scratchy on that one. Let's see. No, that's not gold. Anyway, that's the chain. But I had this little bitty uh, amethyst point, and I put it on this little bitty chain. And it's beautiful. It's got like dark at the top. It's really a pretty one. Um, I can give you measurements if you like. I'm pretty sure they're they're all around 16, I would think. 16. This one is 20. This one is 20 inches. Okay, so 20 inches reaches to the bottom of my little bust. So we'll have to remember that. So that's a little amethyst guy. And then we have this that I had um, on camera just the other day. Oop. Let's flip it around. Flippy, flippy. This is a little D. A little rhinestone D with a little heart. Someone liked this a lot in the comments, but they didn't speak for it, so it is still up for grabs. It's on a regular chain. 
And I'm going to say this one's 16, if not 15. It seems really short. It looks like a child's necklace almost. It is a 16. Okay, so we know whereabouts the 16 is going to fall. And here we go with uh, this one. is just a... Uh, hmm... It's an infinity that I just had on a video that I just made that you haven't seen yet. It is rhinestones. Come on. Let's try to get that to be a little less glary, but you see what I mean. It's a it's a rhinestone -y one. Uh oh. Nope. We're not gonna sell that for a dollar. Not even for a dollar, because look, it's got it's got a missing piece. Missing. It's missing. Right then. I don't know why I have an English accent today. Um, it's just a thing that happens to me sometimes. I couldn't really tell you. I don't know. This one is a double chain with these adorable little lavender and rhinestone. flowers. Two little lavender ones and then a rhinestone one on a 16 inch chain. Chain, pair of chains. Why do I have the Foo Fighters in my head? And there's a mosquito in here. He's feasting upon me. I'm not finding that entertaining at all. Uh, da -da 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 -da. I really want more coffee. Doesn't sound like I need it. Teachers plant seeds that grow forever. And it says, What life? Something life on it. Hold on one moment. Beads of life. Beads of life. So someone made this for their teacher. Teacher. And this one looks to be about 18. It's not stamped very clearly. Or it is, but it's kind of scratched in, it looks like. So if you know a teacher, bless all the teachers that are struggling to educate the children. Hopefully they're all doing it remotely. Because, uh, yeah, because deadly disease, yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, we don't want to talk about that, do we? I'm so sorry that my, um, my bust is all fuzzy. <laughs> no, I don't have a hairy chest. Hold on a moment, I'm going to go tape it and get the tape and clean it off. Be right back. All right, so we're back, but we're not done doing this yet. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> Duct tape actually works better than this packing tape. But, I don't know where I put the duct tape. I really need some better um, buses and things. Is that better? <laughs> Not much. I think that's just what we're going to have to put up with, y'all. Sorry. Okay, this one is not hooked. Hold on. Held in. It does have a really nice hook on it, though. And it has a little bitty teeny weeny mark. Let's see what it is. <laughs> Looks like it says W ping. W ping. There's a nice hook though. Eh. Let's get you hooked so you'll go on my thingamajiggy it's a really nice um, 
snake chain. It looks to be about 16 to 18. It's a gold tone uh, and red enamel. What? Don't do this. There we go. Let's see. Do we want to see it in better color? It's really cool. It looks like it wants to open, but it does not. So, there's the other one. There's another one there. I hope I remember to stop the video in time. If not, we're just going to end up running out of time. And the last one you see is the last one you see. This is adorable. And it seems to be quite a bit longer. I think it's like a 24 with a longer like a three inch extender on it it is black chain it is aurora a cluster of aurora stars they're quite nice and they're really not showing up like they are looking to me they're looking really pretty there you go. Now you can see the greens and the pinks and the purples. Very cool. Yeah, buddy. That's a neat one. Da -da -da. Please feel free to buy more than one because they're only a dollar a piece. And I wish I could go on and on for for hours with this, but my camera has a bad habit of stopping at a half an hour. Um, here's another really nice chain. It feels really cool, but there's no mark on it. Let me see. I'm going to scratch it. I'm going to scratch it. Scratch it. Scratch it. Ooh. I might not be giving you all that one. Hold on. Yeah. Yeah, that one we're going to set aside because I think that's a gold chain. Oops. Whoops. Ow. Ice pick headache. Ow. Jeez. Ice picks in my brains. I don't like it. This is a, ooh, this is a really nice one. He goes on this chain. This is a nice rope chain. It's in really great shape. It's very shiny, shiny. Very shiny, shiny. It did not come with this pendant. This is a... an enamel. And it is... Uh, come on, are you going to fit through there? Yes. No. Yes, no, maybe. Yes. Um, yeah, he fits. No, no, does he not fit? Um, oh, whoop, there he goes. He fits. And, this is ridiculous that I'm letting this go for a dollar, but, can't keep everything, can't get full price for everything. This is a Bob Mackie. It's a Bob Mackie piece. And yes, it is married to this chain. It did not come with this chain. It's gold tone and enamel. There is the Bob Mackie on the backy. It is very clearly readable. If you have a, if you have a one of these, wait, no, wrong. Why is it being a? Uh, pain in the butt. Bob Mackie. Yes, it's a Bob Mackie. So, and it's a really nice, heavy gold tone chain. Because I didn't think I thought this this uh, this bale was kind of chunky, so I wanted to put something substantial with it. So there is your Bob Mackie. Um, please don't be mad at me for getting rid of stuff, because I got so much. I don't, I don't mean to undercut everybody, but I have to unload. 
This is a really cool one. Somebody's out there having fun with their car, apparently. This is a little bitty fishy. Fishy, fishy. Fishy, fishy, fishy. Isn't he cute? He's textured. He's very, very detailed. He's really cool. I like him. He's on a normal chain. He did come on this chain. And this chain has no markings. But it is in very, very good shape. It is not, you know, worn and yucky and gross. Here's another cool one. This, I think, is steel all the way around. I know the pendant is. I'm not really sure what the metal is on the, on the chain. It's just a regular chain. And it's a very vibrant purple. Uh, pendant. Um, I think it's it's a CZ of some sort. It's a might be an Austrian crystal. Something is very very flashy. And wow, look at that under under fluorescent light. It's like really glowy. It looks almost blue, but it's a very lovely purple. Pretty pretty. And that let me see that one's. Seems really short to me, but... I may do a part two of this. This is a 16. 16 inches. I might do a part two because, um... Yeah. Need to get more out there. Um, don't hold me to that, though. Here is a lovely long chain. Very long, very bright, very nice. And it is uh, crowned with this beautiful uh, shell that is um, wrapped in gold. Very nice. Really pretty. Really pretty. Summer's almost over, but you can get away with wearing that a couple more times, hey? You go to the beach. Where in the middle of the winter when you wish you could go to the beach. Of course, I wish I could go to the beach anyway because of this silly disease that's floating around. Still got the dang song in my head. In my head. Oh, who are you? Oh, this is... <laughs> Overstock.com Yes, they sell jewelry as well. Um, this is an interesting one. It's got We are daughters of our Heavenly Father and it has A bunch of little teeny stones. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight. I don't know what the eight represents, if anything. Eight different stones. And this looks to be a 20 inch. It hangs down to this bitch, yeah? Ow, ice pick, ice pick, ice pick. You ever get those ice pick headaches? They're terribly annoying. This, I think, is vintage. Uh, whoop, it doesn't have... I hate when I put them in there and they're not hooked, because then I waste time trying to hook them while I'm trying to show them to you. Eee. Da, da, da. This is definitely a 20-incher. It is a very lovely, shiny, silver uh, wishbone with a very blingy, shiny wishbone. It's a pair of wishbones. Now, I've seen a double wishbone design many, many, many times, and I am not 100% sure what that symbolizes. If anyone is familiar 
because I'm too lazy to look uh, look it up, or I will have forgotten by the time I get in the other room with my computer. Let me know. If you know, let me know. Okay. Okay. Ooh, I like doing this. This is fun. This is definitely vintage. I hear somebody's stereo up loud. I don't live that close to people, so... Maybe somebody's having a big old party. <laughs> That's a bad idea, don't you think? This is a little... Uh, a little heart, a little vintage heart with a dimple. In the middle, I do not think it had a stone. I think it's just meant to be like that. I'm not sure, or you could slap any stone you like in there, I suppose. Make your own crafty crafty. Ooh, this is a cute one. Cute, cute. It is on this popcorn chain, which is not great, but it does match the tone of the piece. It's a little teeny G clef with some rhinestones. And it looks like an 18 incher. Hangs down pretty low. 18, 20 comes down to here, I think, and 18 is about here. It's kind of cool. I like that one too. If I only liked to wear little bitty ones, Lord knows I've got enough of them. Here's a little a tiny butterfly on a really nice snake chain. This is fused at the corners. It has three clear stones and two purple to red stones. There is no mark on it anywhere. Um, it looks to me like a little, like a little Avon piece, maybe. It's very cute. One dollar, one dollar, one dollar. One dollar dainties. Here's another dainty. What a nice chain. Look at that chain. That's another nice snake chains. Heck, if you don't like the pendants on these, you can just buy them for the chains. This is, uh, what did, oh, who was that woman in the 50s, 60s? What the heck? Arlene something. This was her thing. She was on, uh, What's My Line? I forget. But yeah, that was her tra trademark was this, um, rhinestone diamond heart thing. If you wondered. I can't remember what her name is. Ar Ar Arlene Francis, I do believe, was the one that originated that. Hello, my darling boy. Hello, ladies and gentlemen of the realm. How are you doing tonight? <laughs> coffee? Coffee. 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 Coffee, coffee. Coffee, coffee. You brought me coffee? <sighs> Alright, let's get through the rest of this. Here's another little teeny tiny heart. Look at this. This is on a really dainty little chain. Oh, and it looks like it only went through. Look, it only went through one of the one of the thingies there. So we're gonna fix that. <clears throat> hey, when I'm done doing this in like seven minutes or whatever we can turn the music up loud cause ain't nobody home but us chickens and I don't listen to enough music and we do metal and we do classical and we do 8-bit <laughs> from games we do all kinds of everything even some M&M every now and then and some country 
But those aren't my favorite on that. I'm not a fan of lots of rap, and I'm not a fan of lots of country. Here is another little vintage heart necklace. It's like a double heart. It's very cute. It's a 16-inch chain on a little light little chain. It's a very silky little chain. I don't know. You might get lucky with that. It looks like it might be gold filled. Pooper says hello. Is that Pooper? That is Pooper. Okay, well, Pooper says hello tonight. Hmm? He's talking to. It's a little horse with a horseshoe and a little, little blue bead, a little blue plastic bead. That's for the horse girl in your life, I think. I used to be a horse girl. Anyway. There we go. That's a little 16 inch or two. This is a really long one. Well, not really long. But it's longer than the rest of what I've been showing you. And it is a 30 inch chain. It is. It's got a nice long uh, extender as well. And it has these beautiful little purple crystals. Purple and crystally. Look. I can't get the light to hit it right. But you see there, it's a very lovely little purple. Little purple chain. It's 30, 30 inches. And I'm having trouble, <laughs> I'm having trouble showing it. Yeah, that purple gets lost in the uh, in the black there. Hold on a moment. Let's put some white behind it here. There you go. You still can't tell it's purple. <gasps> I don't like my light. Anyway, it's a 30 inch plum purple and gold tone layering chain. Very nice. And Max is out there making kissy sounds. Kissy, kissy. This is, we are at 27, so we're almost done. It's a little ball chain, little tiny one with a rhinestone ball on it. Slidey ball. And it has a decent sized, um... Yeah, one of them. Um, 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 extender. It's about 16 inches. Probably 18 with the extender. Okay. There we go. Ooh, I'm almost to the bottom of the pile. Oh, here's a cute little cross. Very plain, very plain steel cross on a steel chain with no extender and that is about 18 inches it's very pretty very plain very nice that's a church going one I'm proud to wear that every every Sunday every Sunday okay here's another cross Ooh, heck, we're at 29. This one is thinner. It is it is embossed. It has a cute little embossed design on it. Protestant cross. It does not have a an extender, but it is a 20-incher. It's very pretty. That's another one for your Sunday morning. There we go. All right. Well, I think we're about done. I only have one, two, three, four. I only have like five left. So next week or sometime soon, we'll do another 
We'll do another one because I have way more. I have more of these little ones coming up in my lot. Um, this is a little swallow with a ch on a chain. And it looks to be about an 18er. And that is our last one. Please remember, if you would like to buy one of these necklaces for a dollar, please leave the exact timestamp in the comments below. And uh, if I have not dealt with you before, please send me your name, your PayPal email, your uh, address, and your um, uh, YouTube name to my email, which is in my description. And that way I can invoice you for your order. All y'all that know me and have dealt with me before, just make sure, everybody, make sure that your timestamps are precise. Okay? So, uh, good luck, everyone. I hope you all get the ones that you want. And I love each and every one of you. And be yourself, because everyone else is taken. Bye-bye!